Hi guys, compliment of the season. I'm in London. <laughs> so this vlog is going to be about um my experience as a mom traveling with my toddler. Where do I start from? I think I'm going to start by saying I have issues with those aesthetics moms that make traveling with toddlers on TikTok look like it's one very easy thing. It was hella chaotic for me when i mean chaotic from <laughs> trying to calm my child to backing him with rappers and african mom on the plane me <laughs> it doesn't sound true but believe me trust me i backed my child because at some point he became so cranky and i didn't know what to do <laughs> so um this vlog is about my trip from nigeria to doha then getting another flight down to london i mean why go directly to london when you can go to two countries at a time so <laughs> don't mind me i'm seeing a lot of rubbish but i am also trying to talk as low as possible because my toddler is sleeping next to me i wouldn't want to wake him up because I'm sure he's tired and everything, so join me on this vlog. And I hope you enjoy it. Also, don't forget to like, comment, ask questions. Honestly, I am here for all your questions. Ask questions and subscribe. Also, so here I was packing my toddler's essentials with the help of his nanny. Really I had already packed my things before so um, I remember I was supposed to record this mm -hmm. video. You can notice that I have a lot of his food, his um, his shoes, his his skincare products, which is basically his cream, and it's a particular brand, Sebamed. <laughs> you guys won't believe they seized it at the airport, but I would come to. The so we got to the airport. I carried his pram for easier movement, which I know is very very essential. And it was easy for me to carry my luggages and all. Another thing I noticed at this airport was the checkpoint i was tired because at some point my child became cranky and i had to carry him while i move i know you make use of the pram and then i carried him a lot i kept on asking ah, are we not done with the checkpoints they were like eh, it's because it's international airport and stuff that's why all of these things are needed i was like okay let's go <laughs> and i think our flight was supposed to be for 12 12 p.m and then we got there earlier for everything we had to do finally it was time to board i could view the plane from where we were that was i think that was like the last checkpoint until we get to the plane we finally got into the plane they handed us some care packages that included toothbrushes nose mask um earphones lots and lots of other things uh it was Qatar airline although before they brought this oh yeah they also gave us blankets before they brought all of this or before this trip what am i saying i'd already done a research on trust me now to check because i'm traveling with a toddler so i got my baby ready i sat him on my chair because i was trying to like make arrangements for my hand luggage and all see how he's relaxed big man like he knew how we were living in nigeria like he knew what was going on and then they brought um, a life jacket for the toddler and they gave him a toy this toy was really cute but i was wondering why it was just born because this toy is really tiny for come see because i know my child he, like he needs a lot and a lot of distractions that was the screen where we could see how the movement of the flight was going hmm. nice i enjoyed the fact that i could tell and then they brought this baby bassinet for Camp C. Every mom that had a baby or a toddler on the plane received a bassinet each for when baby sleeps. Beside my chair had a screen too, which I turned on for movie or for cartoon for my kid just to distract him. And 
I was so tired and hungry and then it was food time. So this really nice queue member, she was always smiling, brought me food and asked me what I needed. I made my choice. <laughs> you know, we're always having rice in Nigeria. So this time when she said rice, I'm like, oh, sorry, let me have the other one. She called some name, which I, I didn't hear. So she said, okay okay you can have this so i <laughs> she helped me with getting out my tray which was beside my chair so i didn't even know that was there but thank god for experience she helped me with opening it and then i placed my food on the table it was see my child down there playing it was really nice it was yogurt potatoes um some chicken stuff inside with sauce that bread was so tasteless very very tasteless but i downed it down with the um with the coca-cola which was given to us yeah that's the sauce the chicken and potato my child enjoyed the potato then it was time for my baby's meal they gave us this puree cerelac puree which was really nice of them i love that they also they don't just plan for the adults they plan for the babies too because I, although I packed food for Cam Cam, I didn't expect them to give me meal for my child, but it was nice of them to bring this packaged Cerelac puree thingy because my child really, really enjoyed it. And then they got another package, a care package for Cam C. It contained diaper, diaper wipes, diaper storage bags, um, cushion cream, and the powder. Although my baby doesn't really need, use this, um, this particular brand because he uses only hypoallergenic things but it was nice to know that we had it and then we got the six hour the seven hours seven and a half hours flight finally ended we got to doha this is doha they have the most beautiful people i've seen in my whole life and i also heard in 2022 they won best airport this is kamsi <laughs> i told you people we back to this boy even on plane and at the first stop which was doha we backed him because of how cranky as i said i have issues with tiktok and instagram moms that makes traveling with toddlers look like it is one very easy, easy thing it is not though better add your rapper also at doha they had this play corner for kids my son really had lots of fun and look at him walking <laughs> he went to meet other children then it was time for us to get our flight information remember we're still on our way to london i wanted to know when we we're supposed to leave finally we boarded the plane and they served us the first meal which was a snack sandwich and apple juice which was my own option i'm sorry there are different options but then i picked this i tried uh, making videos of myself <laughs> Because this was another flight of six hours. My child finally fell asleep and then we made use of the bassinet. He slept on it for a while because it was a bit small. He tried turning and then woke up. I had to bring him out and carry him on my lap. Then it was time for the food this time around. It was a frittata, which was what they called it. But to me, it was a fiesta. Ah with potatoes fried potatoes and fruits and um it came with some other really nice things then i my drink was coffee i picked coffee because i was beginning to feel really cold on this second flight i made use of my blanket which was given to us finally we got to london then I cut this really cute video of my baby. He was trying to cry, but then I cut it. Bye.